Hi friends, we are at Kura Revolving Sushi. It's our favorite, well, one of our favorite places. There's two locations, one in Garden Grove and one in Irvine. We're at the one in Garden Grove today. I love the Irvine one a little bit more, but it's a little further and super busy today. So if you guys have never been here, I'll link everything in the description if you're ever in town and want to swing by and get some sushi but basically it is revolving oh mom huh? will you grab me the sweet shrimp both <laughs> or oh thank you so much yes both both thank you i'm here for the sweet shrimp it is my all-time favorite it is so good but yeah basically you sit here in these really comfortable little seating areas and there is sushi revolving around you and you can just pick and choose what you want and take it off or you can also do custom orders up there and then the food will come out at the top mom is that yours? What? Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi there. How so when you, you know? <laughs> when you order up there, the food will come out here. All the sushi chefs are in the back there making your sushi. Oh, they changed the plate. Michelle ordered me a miso soup. Excuse me. Can I get another pair of chopsticks? Thank you. Thank you. There's also this little robot here. Oh, oh hi, bye. robot. So excited. What's wrong? Oh, no, they put an extra bowl on the thing, and I was uh -huh. like, uh. Oh, my God, I'm so hungry, Mom. Oh, same. I agree. Ooh, oh, miso. Thank you. Thank you so much. Got a little bit of miso. Oh, that's so yums. That is so yums. We have sweet shrimp. Sweet shrimp's my favorite here. It's like the only reason I go here, <laughs> other than the other sushis. How much is a plate, Mom? Is it still, what, $2? It should say somewhere. Yeah, so every plate that you eat. I think it's two fifty. It's like around $2, $2.50. And when you're done, you put the plate down here. And the machine will count it for you, and that's how you pay at the end. So we have all of this. I'm going to go in with the sweet shrimp. Oh my god, so good. Is it good, Mom? Mm-hmm. Michelle got ramen. You can order ramen here. Ooh. It's udon too. Oh yeah. Wow. So when you're done, you just put it down here. Oh, oh it's Little stuck. Tail. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, that's good. Snow crab. Got snow crab. That's so good. Just thank you, party. So, uh, <laughs> do you want anything from here, Mom? Um, no? I think I want something from here. Salmon. Is this the one I like or this one? This one, right? Just salmon? Oh, yes. I didn't see that. One. Oh, your thing is on the way. That was fast. That was so Holy fast. Crap. Oh my gosh. Order. And then I saw the octopus. I want the octopus. Oh, didn't we like something from here? Yeah. The, the crispy squid. Yes, get the crispy squid. One or two? Two. Where did you get the octopus the earlier? Octopus. There was like an octopus up here? Mm, let me see. Oh, sh that's fast. Wait, Salmon's coming. They are on it. They're on it today. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Got salmon. Ooh, nice. Um, Let me see. I don't know where you were. 
Oh, yeah, I was here. Oh, in the next. Oh, okay, I see. Here we go. Oh. You're like, I swear, I saw it. I know. Sometimes I like to get like a few. It's more fun that way. Yeah. Is that all we got from here? Oh, those are new. Fried scallop and oh, fries shoot. and stuff. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna go in with my salmon. Oh my God, it looks so good. Oh, we have to ask for spicy mayo. They don't. Oh, they do have our dessert. Mm. Oh my god, the salmon just melts in your mouth. Thank you. Oh no, I'm still working on it. Thank you so much. Your octopus is here. I just here. want to let you know the coke. It's coking. It's coking. Yay! We got octopus. Oh, I forgot to ask for spicy mayo. Mm. Well, mm -hmm. a chopstick is stuck to you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> is there wasabi, Mom? Um, yes, they have their fresh wasabi. Ooh, yay. She got her favorite. I find it everywhere. Very good. so good. Wait, mom, is it like better than it was before? Do you ever just want to? Yeah, I do. I just want to, I just want to grab it. It's good today. It's really good. We might be like really hungry. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. I'll take another one. Do you think we can ever um, film what? a mukbang without saying so good? No. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm, yeah. mm. mm. Jalapeno on top. I think that's fresh wasabi too. Is it? Mm -hmm. It's really good. Thanks, mm. fun. Wow. Oh, maybe it is jalapeno it's too. It's jalapeno or something. It's There's so, a seed. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. It's delicious. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. The jalapeno on top makes it good. Mm. I don't know. Don't explain it. Wow. Ooh, that second one looks bad. Oh, have just, you had? No, I haven't. I had it earlier. It's really good. Bomb. Mm. Wow. wow. Mm. Mm. The salmon is really good here. Oh no, I lost my rice. Oh no. Uh, Forfeit. Yeah, I don't know about these tables, man. 
Corvette. Like, oh, that was your forfeit? Here. shit in york oh my gosh they, they eat it up would they i think so because it's so like different oh. Ah. oh my goodness real crab meat is that new mm -mm. I it. do i like it i don't know i'll do this one i don't remember i don't remember either is it really real it does look real yum it looks real. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> you okay? Mm hmm. They really like their hand rolls. Oh, whoever's ordering it? Yeah. The sweet shrimp with the jalapeno is your new favorite. Is my favorite. That's so good. Yum. Yum. Revolving sushi in Newport and Fashion Island. Yes, we went there. It wasn't that good. I didn't eat there. Oh, oh, I went with um that person. Okay. That face. Which one? The, the backstabbing that one? one. Oh. Oh hi. Oh, there are you. Too uh, bougie. Thank mm. you, Mom. But I'm wondering if like the sushi quality is better. You know. Oh. How funny, when we used to eat this, we didn't eat this shishito pepper. No, we do. <laughs> I know. <laughs> the crispy squid. Mm -hmm. ah. Oh, it's hot, hot. It's really hot, but the best thing ever. Mm -hmm. I agree. Oh, mm. Yeah. Mm. So good. Oh my God, I love it. Whoa. Hey, are they having a party? They're having a party oh down there. Wow. Bomb. Excuse me. Can we get eel sauce and spicy mayo? Uh, one of each. Um, just like one. One of each? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yes. 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 Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I was like, what? I, what? I was like, wait, no, not one for each. <laughs> just one of each. <laughs> yeah, my. What? What? It's updating. It's mom. It's two seconds. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Oh, it's yuzu jalapeno. Yuzu. Yuzu. Is that the like dog. citrus? I know you think of the dog. <laughs> what are you thinking of? The fruit. It's like a citrusy. Oh, yuzu. Yeah. I'm thinking of my one of my favorite golden retrievers, yuzu. I know you are. And kiwi. Oh, I miss them so much. Yuzu and kiwi. You guys, 
So um, one of my subscribers, she has a two golden retrievers, y Yuzu and Kiwi. I literally watched them for a weekend and almost cried because I want a golden retriever so bad. You had to live out your dream. Yeah, I ate a bunch of hairballs. Uh huh. <laughs> I want to do that again. I want to see you do. Once we're like a little bit more free, I we know. should do a sleepover. We should. Because you're going to die when you see Kiwi go on a walk. Oh, I know I'm going to die. Remember Lean? Oh, I know. Oh, what was it? Is it Anthony? Oh. Andrew. No, um, it was Anthony and Jacqueline. Yes. No, it's uh, Anthony. Show him. <laughs> no, it was because. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. It's because she was talking up a storm and she was like, yeah, okay, we can do all of these. I didn't order that. You did one. No, I didn't order that. I know it popped up too. Yeah. I tried that one time. Never yeah, tried it again. Um, remember, Jacqueline was like, "Yeah, Q, we can do all these tricks." Yes. <laughs> um, she was like, "Oh yeah, he does this cute thing. He can lean like, and then, then show." Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it's my favorite. Hmm. You guys, the first time we came here, mm -hmm. I was like, who in the world grabs the watermelon here? And as I was saying it, Kim grabbed the watermelon and ate it. <laughs> it's how I feel about when we go to buffets and you get french fries. Yes. <laughs> but I have to. I have to I get at least three to taste yeah. it. I will never fig, uh, fig. forgive uh, <clears throat> the Bucanel. Why? They have some really fun looking fries. Uh-huh. They put barbecue sauce all over it. That should be illegal. Because it's like dirty Texas fries or something. And I'm like, are you kidding? Why well, someone wants it clean? Mm. Oh, spicy mail, mom. Oh, yeah. Grassy up. Oh, hello again. <laughs> What's that, mom? Eel sauce. Eel sauce. <laughs> Did you try the salmon? Oh, no, I didn't even know it was over here. Yeah, I gave you one. Thank you. What's your dream dog? Did you see that golden doodle? Yeah. When I said you. I had my windows down. I screamed so loud. The guy looked at me. I was like, oh, sorry. <laughs> that is the cutest dog I've ever Did seen. Did you see his uh -huh. hair? Mm -hmm. His head? So long. The hair is so big, but I know his little brain is tiny. If I wasn't driving, I, I would have been <laughs> all up in that. I know you would have. Mmm. I really want a Doberman. Okay, what? That's so random. Did you always want that? I do really want a Doberman. Mm. I'm not a Doberman. Wait, why? You look so good with a big dog, Mom. I don't like, know. Like, you look so good with Riley. I love, uh, yeah. I love Riley. I love Dobermans. Um, but I want them to have their long, floppy ears. Oh, me too. I don't want them with the... They're probably so cold. I know, right? Yeah. Why do they cut off um, their ears? Is there a medical condition? You know, some people say medical condition. Some people say it's really just for style. Mm. I think it really depends because I'm like, I can't imagine what kind of medical conditions because I'm like, Clem and Cooper, I they have really know. long ears too. Uh, Cooper gets um, ear infections often. Oh, does he? So it's his ears, like. Clem does it, yeah. but that's probably it. Have you seen it. Cooper's ears though? Oh yeah, yeah. I know. He sits there itching it. I love when he itches it with I one leg out him. and one leg in there. <laughs> I love him so much. Oh my god, that picture I took of him on Wednesday was the cutest. Him I love on the him. couch. Yeah. <clears throat> I feel like. What's your second dog that you want?
I feel like sometimes they give too much rice. I agree. Um, I mean, in a dream world, I would love a Riley. An old lady soup doll? My heart. I love Riley. I think I really nailed it with all the dogs that I have. You have kind of like... Yeah, I love all of my a dogs. A variety of dogs. Yeah. Um, I, I mean, do. I have a dream dog. Hmm. I'm so lucky to have her. Yeah. Because I know a lot of people want small poodle dogs. Yes. I want a golden retriever, but I just don't know if I'm ready for that lifestyle. With yeah. Because like, currently the three boys don't really shed. Mm -hmm. It is a completely different, different. transition. However... Should the opportunity <laughs> present itself where mm -hmm. we can rescue a golden retriever, I'm down. No hesitation. I will deal with the hair. I don't give a fuck. I will rescue. Yeah. Really? Yeah. So we'll do it. Yeah. But what if what if you have in a magical dream opportunity? Okay. You have an opportunity to either rescue a golden and you can only take one. Okay. A golden doodle or a golden retriever. And say they're already lined up. Like, they have homes, but you're the next in line to choose. Like, oh. which one would you like? Like, don't think of it in an effed up way. Um, oh, that's hard. I know. Do I have other dogs in the house? You don't get to take both. No, no, I'm just saying. Oh. Like, if, let's say you do. Okay. Like, I'm sure your boys, I'm sure. Is Riley still alive? Damn. <sighs> See, there's a lo I'm a logical dog owner. How I does like, that change your mind, though? Because Riley is a really big dog, and he's a lot of responsibilities. So if Riley was alive, but you had three, say, like it's not. I'm not adopting. No. You're what? I'm not getting a f a fourth dog that's big. <laughs> oh, I see what <laughs> yeah. you're saying. I, yeah, okay. that's a okay, lot. Okay, so say time has passed and Riley. Say you're down to two dogs. Okay, so it's Cooper and yes. Casper. Let's say. Okay. I would have to think about um, the behavior aspect of it because mm. Casper's got a lot of, um, you know. Past trauma. Yeah, past trauma, but also like behavior, oh. um, things that we're working on yeah, still. Yeah, yeah, and he's yeah. gotten a lot better. Yeah. So I would say that from past experiences, he's not going to love the Golden Retriever. Mm. He would get better. He would get along better with the Golden Doodle. I see. Um, so I would have to c take that into consideration. That makes yeah. sense. But yeah, that would be hard. Now, if I didn't have any dogs, they're both coming home with me. Oh, one thousand percent. I do. I don't even doubt it. I already know the answer. <laughs> However, like that one incident where I was about to get the golden doodle, mm -hmm. and um, the rescue team was like, "Hey, it's either you or this someone pers else. This person with a huge backyard. I would want what's best for the dog, and you should go there. You know? Yeah. So. Yeah, I'm pretty logical when it comes to that. But I'm good. Four is... Would you ever do four again? Would I ever do four dogs again? The answer would be no. <laughs> but I would not I trade it. I will say, it. though, I and I, I saw the hard part. Oh, you, yeah, you saw everything that no one saw. I will say, though, you guys put so much effort and training and time mm -hmm. and learning... What was, you guys, it is not easy having three rescues. I mean, especially when two come from such a traumatic yeah. past. It is hard. And they're animals. Like, as much as we love our dogs, they're animals. Yeah. That's scary. I agree. As like, much you as, guys did that. That's crazy. As much as dogs are, like, our babies, like, you know how much I love my dogs. Yeah. But at the end of the day, you have to remember they're animals. They are. Yeah. But I love them. I miss them so much. <laughs> I know. You're going to see them in a little bit. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm just going to sleep the rest of the day with them. <laughs> Casper's going to be so excited when he sees you. Fucking love Casper. I wish people could meet them. Can you imagine a meeting great with all of my dogs? Casper would go insane. Casper would go, like, crazy. I don't even want to know what would happen, actually. <laughs> 
Did I order something and it's not here? I don't think so. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I ordered something. I thought oh, wait, I ordered this. Order status. Hold on. Order. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, no, because remember? I ate it. I hold ate on. it already. No, hold on, hold on. I'm ordering it. Oh, my God. <laughs> What? Oh what gosh. happened? I ordered it. No, because you can check, Mom. Oh. I think that's it, though. Yeah, that's what I thought. I want to check traffic home right now. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Zero traffic. Fuck yeah. Love it. <sighs> so good. You think you'll have dogs the rest of your life? Like after Clem passes, you'll get another one. You're not gonna, you're not gonna like have a time where you're not gonna have a dog, right? Like you're pretty into it now? I'm pretty into it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I guess it'll really depend on my lifestyle. Yeah. I will say I heard people get lonely after having a dog, like a companion yeah, I for don't, life. I don't think... I don't think you can ever... If you really love dogs, like, I don't know how... But I only know that I would get through it because you have dogs. Oh, okay. Like, if I had to. I will tell you, there is never going to be a time in my life where I don't have a dog. Like, um, I definitely will always have a dog. I don't think that I will not not have a dog. Like, I will always have one dog. I think the hardest part might be transitioning from a 13-pound dog to a 100-pound dog. If you ever do that, you'd be like, whoa, everything is so much more. I guess, yeah, but not really because it's like I see you guys do it with Riley. Mm. Like, I already know what to expect. Right. So, I mean, triple her food and there you go. Mm. Triple, maybe double, double, triple the food. And the groomer. And the groomer. And the vet. And the vet. <laughs> Everything. Yeah, big dogs are expensive for sure. Uh huh. But I love them. I feel like they're more. I don't know. Big dogs feel like they fill the room more. Mm. Do you well, know what I mean? Yeah, but also for me, it's like, have you ever spooned Riley? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I wish he would spoon me once in a while. He does. He no, tries, he but he like knocks you out. Knocks you out instead. <laughs> He's like, "Here, let me put my arm around you." Well, I hope your next dog doesn't give you attitude. I love my little attitude, baby. <laughs> my favorite is when you're sad, and she doesn't give a flying fuck oh about you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, but Cooper gives me attitude all the time, and you no, see he it. Yeah, he does. Mm -mm. Or have you ever done something and he looks at yeah, you? That, oh, yeah, all the time. Like, what is wrong with you? Every he glares single, at you. Every single day. <laughs> you know he does that to me? He comes up to me, he doesn't look cute, but like, you itches. <laughs> well, first of all, I'm like, Cooper, read the room. I was, <laughs> I was petting your brother who is 100 pounds. How am I going to get rid of <laughs> yeah. him so quickly? Because he'll be like, oh, it's my turn. But you know, Riley doesn't let down uh -huh. easily. And so he'll scratch and scratch, and then eventually he leaves, so then he goes to you. Uh -huh. And he sits there, and he's like... I've never met a dog that glares. Like, oh, and Clem's side eye, I can't. I'm like, oh my God, you hate me. I love it though. Clem, Clem. Clem punishes me when I come home from Kim's house. That's so sad. <laughs> she punishes, I'm in a toxic relationship, y'all. You really are. You guys think that I'm in a healthy relationship? But, no. she, but she can't live without you. She controls me. She, she can't live without you though. She can't. No, that's what the sad part is. It mm. really makes me sad that like, because she loves me so much, yeah, she only depends on me, and it hurts so much. Because mm. I'm like, I know that your whole world is me, but it's like I have so much going on. Like you know, I know, but that's for every dog owner. I know, but it makes me sad. Nope. Are you gonna cry? Don't cry. No. Suck it back in. Okay. <laughs> Stop fucking crying. We're okay. at a safe place. Okay. <laughs> Don't cry. <laughs> I drink my water. Kim and I cry about everything these days. It's like a hobby of ours. I don't know, I don't know what it is. Is it early menopause? When I turn, no, we're so far. <laughs> when I turned 30, everything made me cry. 
I'm not even 30, so what the heck is wrong no, with me? No, but it started right now. Oh my God, this is horrible. I was like, why am I crying right now? I remember. There was something weird. Like, there was I can start weird. crying right now for no reason. Okay, no. It's like, it's so fucked Stop. up. No. <laughs> Suck it back in. Put it back. <laughs> I like the little yuzu thing on top. You want me to go back there and ask them for a bucket of it? Can you ask them to do it without the rice? <laughs> Very good. Look, New York cheesecake, mom. Oh my goodness, Brent, I didn't even know you were here. <laughs> it's been there, no? Thank God I looked. I think after this, I'm gonna go, um, I'm gonna peek into Chiacali mm. and see if they're in a good, good, uh, good, uh, Mood? Uh, if they're looking kind of mean, I'm going yeah, again. All right. I'll just do what you do. <laughs> I want to buy some jack. Oh, hello again. <laughs> What's wrong? I don't know what to do with that thing. Just leave it there and we'll tell them, be like, hey, we didn't want it sitting here. They can't give it to anyone either. That's the Yeah. Thing. We didn't order that for sure. Well, that sucks. Huh? So, the, well, that sucks. Mmm. Mmm. I wonder if Skylark is open. It is. Oh, it is? Yeah. I'm a little home. In the room. Yeah. I want to go too. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna look for some colors for Oma. You doing gel tonight? Yeah. Oh, yo, those jeans are screaming like Gen Z. I yeah, love it. I know. I told her I didn't like them. I don't love them. I told her I didn't like them, but she likes them, so that's all that matters, I guess. And you know what? When you're almost fifty, well, who cares? So yeah, my mom I said like, keep the shirt. I said keep the shirt simple, and you'll be fine. My mom's idea of being young is bright colors. Mm. So she'll like step out and like mm. blood orange. Nice. Yeah. Nice. You know what though? Blood orange on her skin tone and hair is nice. Not bad. Not bad. Mm -hmm. I remember when my mom was like younger. Mm -hmm. She used to like not like certain type of like clothing because it made her look older. Mm -hmm. And then I think like a year or two ago we were shopping and she's like, I, I must be getting older. The glitter? The glitter. She was like, I really like the glitter in the sequence. Like, why? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, it must be a thing. I yeah. don't know. When you grow old, you just. My mom loves patterns. Like sometimes, <laughs> I'm like, mom, you got a whole like Willy Wonka maze on you right now. I'm not down. <laughs> Willy Wonka maze. <laughs> it. Yeah. I don't know what it is. They like. I think it's fine. Things. I think they're just like, oh my god, I'm old, like, oh. it's like, keep it like hip, you know, young, oh, hip, right? So, oh. While all the young kids are like, are like neutral, muted, yes. muted, black. Seriously. <laughs> our, our fashion has changed everywhere. Uh, oh yeah, it was. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, oh sure. Thank you. Um, we Thank also you. ordered the sweet shrimp, but they actually gave us the wrong fish. Right, I don't um, know what to do with it. Oh, uh, just it was a sweet shrimp, right? It was um here. I can show you. It was this first one. Yeah. All right, I'll, I'll save you. Okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. She's so cute. Oh my god. Yeah. What? I didn't even realize he was. Well, when he came out, I was like, oh, I didn't order that. I know. Me too. I was like, oh. I did, I thought I didn't know it was a restock. Very nice of him. What's that? I don't know. Oh, I'm not too sure. I have a feeling he went to the wrong person. Oh my god. I know. Oh my god. I'm like, sweetie, broccoli. Oh my god. <laughs> What's wrong with you? What is going on? What are you, why are you spiraling? Why, is she spiraling? I'm not spiraling. Why are you spiraling? No. What did you see? Nothing. An ex-lover? No. 
They don't live here. <laughs> Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> What'd you say? No, really, though. No, I just had the giggles. Oh. So bad. Are you full? Huh? Are you full? Yeah, I'm. 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 I can see. Opening I can tell. up my entryway for this guy. Okay, this is when we go dessert route. Ooh. I think it's that first one, the taiyaki, the tai taiyaki. What do you mean? It's the second one. Oh yeah, you're right. How Japanese did we ever get a fish? I don't know. <laughs> that price up to six freaking dollars mom everything has gone up in price those yeah those donut pieces are just are smaller than my pieces of shit yeah and ew <laughs> everything goes up in price now it's crazy we live in a world where everything's just so expensive so five just <laughs> <laughs> no share one. one share one well they give us an odd amount of donuts man i don't want the donuts you like the donut. I do like one donut. You have two. She's lying to me because last I'm time not. we got it, she ate all the donuts. I don't donuts. know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. <laughs> What's this new one? Hmm? I don't know. Wait, I'm sorry. We're only at 17 plates. We always hit 30 plates. Are we skinny? You and I, You're in, eating the last, less? in the last three months, have significantly yeah lessened our well interest. it's not really showing on my face i feel it i feel skinny you do I feel like heidi montag heidi why heidi montag why heidi montag oh you know why i was going heidi klum oh but you went the montag <laughs> yeah, route i don't know why i did that that's so weird I'm to go sorry. the montag route. could we somehow get that cut out <laughs> I don't I want to loved, re be remembered that way. I loved Heidi um, before the plastic surgery. She was really pretty. I thought pretty. she looked gorgeous. But I mean, obviously. Oh my God, no. That's, we didn't no, that's another mine. One. That's mine. Oh, you ordered it. Yes. Oh, my God. I thought they sent us I another think, one. But I think, like, everyone should do whatever, like, makes them feel good. Oh, yeah. Like, if she mm -hmm. feels like she needed it, do it. It's your body. But I thought she looked really pretty before. I think when it comes to any type of plastic surgery or just, like, even injections. I love I her hair, though. <laughs> I was—I don't know what the fuck she did to her hair from season one to season three on the hills. I don't probably know if it's some type of fucking implant. We just started taking care of it. It was so. It was like a major night and day. Yeah. It was so pretty. It is still pretty, actually. I think when it comes to altering your face, it should be a very long thought process mm -hmm. I don't think it should be made lightly unless you are fixing something like a nose if it's crooked or like there's a bump I get that yeah uh, I believe she's had a lot of surgeries 25 okay yeah but was that real yeah she like did everything at once and could have died on the table what? Yeah. Oh, I, I thought can't. It, I was really hoping it was the tabloids. No, I can't oh name it. Oh my but god! It's it's in the season of the hills. That's she insane. comes back. I think when she comes back in season five at the beginning, she sits there and tells her mom everything she did, and it was like crazy, like hairline, so you can eyelid. So you can literally see her change through the whole season. Oh yeah, from from the hills season one to season five or six, it was like a major change. You can also tell they started making bank. Uh, yeah, you well know? I'm assuming that's why and how she yeah. did it. Either connections or because she gotta, had money. You gotta look at this hair, I wanna show you. It was like a major transformation. Yeah, I'm like what? I mean I saw her flat hair. I remember the flat hair. Yeah, by season three homegirl had like Barbie like layered hair. It was really pretty. Oh, that was really fast. I thought it was gonna take longer. Mmm. Little donuts. Have you seen Kelly Clarkson mm. sing everyone's song? Mm -hmm. And they sound so much better than mm -hmm. the original artist. She nails it every time. Did you see the Gen Z kids who are like, who is this person? Blah, blah, blah. And everyone's like, I'm sorry. But that's how our parents probably thought of us. Probably. Yeah.
Do you like Olivia Rodrigo? Mm. Or is she too Gen Z? I don't really care. Her music's catchy. I have a few of her songs, but I don't listen to them after the hype. Mm, so I, I like driver's license. Like Hi friends, my camera died. <laughs> but we just finished um, having dinner. This is the outside of Kura. Thank you so much for watching. I'll post the address and the locations down below if you guys are interested in coming by. Thank you so much for having dinner with us. Bye.